Hi everybody, today we're going to do our very first product review video. I wanted to get into doing product reviews and someone found me on Instagram before I even announced I wanted to do them and asked me to review one of their products. Today we're going to review a dust mask. So a company called Basecamp sent me this package for their dust masks and I haven't opened it yet. We're going to go ahead and open it up and I'll let you know what's inside the package, how it works. Um, I have a real sensitivity sometimes with black walnut and that's really the only time I use a dust mask when I'm turning. Uh, if I'm sanding I'll put a dust mask on but when I'm actually doing the turning the chips are big enough I don't wear a dust mask. I know I probably should. Uh, but we're going to go ahead and turn some black walnut and we're going to use this dust mask and see how I feel after. Normally when I turn black walnut uh, my throat closes up a little bit. Very sensitive to it and I sneeze and I cough a lot and I feel it for a couple of hours afterwards. So I love turning black walnut so hopefully this will help me out. So let's go ahead and review Basecamp's dust masks. Here's a package that the dust masks come in. They are active carbon filters. They give you instructions on the back. So there's a lot of instructions on the back. It tells you how to fit the product, um, suggested applications, care and cleaning and storage, uh, tell you the lifespan of the filter, a little bit about their technology, return policy. This company has been really easy to work with. I've emailed them a couple of times. They've emailed me a couple of times. So I'm really excited to go ahead and rip into this. So let's go ahead and do that next. Here's everything you get in the packet, and I am very impressed. You get two masks. You get two straps. You get this instruction pamphlet that shows you what the straps are used for to tighten up the masks. You get two of these exhalation valve caps. And then you get six other charcoal filters. And you also get this really nice little thank you. Dear customer, thank you for your purchase. So how cool is that? A lot of companies don't do that. And then they tell you a little bit about how to order their product on Amazon. And I just think it's really cool. So let's look at the construction of these masks. First thing is I'm really impressed with the way they're built. They are very solid. They're not, you know, the cheap little disposable ones that you find a lot. The one thing I really like is that there is Velcro on the back. So, um, he's, <laughs> this is great. Um, they're very easy to put on. They come with ear straps on either side. You just slip them over your ears. And then you just take the Velcro, connect it in the back, and look at that. It fits really, really well. And I can breathe very easy. And the best thing is, when I exhale, it does not fog up my glasses. That is the greatest thing for those of us who wear glasses. Every time you're putting a mask on and you have glasses, you always have that fog. This is great because they have little exhale caps on the front. And if you breathe with these, all your exhale goes out the front. These caps are also interchangeable. On the inside, oh, one thing to tell you too is even though you're getting six replacements, each of the masks already come with a filter built into it. So you actually have eight activated charcoal filters. But let me show you how these caps work. So these are exhale caps. So as you breathe on the inside, your exhale goes through here and then it comes out these if you're wearing these. But you just twist the inside a little bit, pop them off, and then you get these exhale prevention caps. You put them on, turn them, and then when you put them on, instead of breathing through the holes here, your breath would go out through the fabric. So you can wear these in public. They're good for the pandemic. Um, so instead of spreading your germs with the exhale here, you can go ahead and use one of these and then all your germs go through the activated charcoal filter. The other thing I like about it is when you put them on, if you need to adjust your nose, there's a very sturdy kind of hard rubber area here and you could go ahead and bend that to make a really good fit. But when I put them on right away, they fit perfect. I didn't have to make any adjustments. Now, if it, if you're too saggy, that's what these straps are for that they sent you. So you can uh, put your straps through the ear holes, 
put it above your head and make it even tighter if that's what you need. And if you need to do that, this instruction book that they sent you gives you all the instructions on how to do that, which I think is great. So um, every time you have a new system, it's good to have some instructions. And there's a little FAQ section in here, and then it tells you how to tighten and, and loosen up your, your straps. So overall, I think this is a really great product. I'm really happy to, to try this out. So we're going to go ahead, we're going to get strapped up, and we're going to turn some black walnut. And then I'm going to let you know how I felt after I wore them and if I'm still being, you know, having that sensitivity that I do with black walnut. So I have the outside of the black walnut bowl already roughed out and I am, you know, producing lots of black walnut shavings. And you know what? I'm going to put it right here by the mask just to show you that I am not getting any sensitivity at all. I'm not coughing. I don't feel anything in my throat. Uh, my eyes are not... Well, my eyes aren't watering up, but they usually don't. Uh, usually it's with my respiration. So um, this is right here. I'm using the exhale valves too, and I'm not feeling anything. But the real test is going to be when I sand this, because that's when the really fine particulate really gets in. So we're going to go ahead and sand this, and I'll let you know how I feel after that. I just finished sanding the outside of my bowl and I want to show you my eyes. Now normally my eyes don't get sensitive to black walnut but sometimes they do. This is a case where they are so I don't know if you can tell but my eyes are watering a little bit and there's some sensitivity around the eye. I put my mask up to make sure that I got a lot of dust in my face so I, I put this up but I will tell you Wearing this dust mask, I don't feel anything in my throat. I don't feel anything in my nose. Uh, so this mask is really preventing that dust that really sensitizes uh, my respiratory system from getting in. Uh, I wish it was <laughs> cover my eyes because it would be a lot better. So my eyes will be a little sensitive for a couple of hours. But I'm going to go ahead and finish the bowl and not worry about anything affecting the way I'm breathing. So base camp. Good job. I'm going to show you guys the final bowl at the end of the video, and I'll have some stuff uh, down here where you can see about base camp. But I would say if you guys are looking for a respiratory system, a mask that's very easy to wear, very comfortable, doesn't make you ultra hot, and you can breathe really, really easily on it, uh, I would say check out base camp. Good job, guys. I also want to take this apart and show you that there is dust trying to get in. So this is the outside of the mask just after the first sanding. Not sure if you can tell the dust that's sitting in there. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to take this off and show you what it looks like on the inside. So we're going to just unscrew it a little bit. Pops off very easy. And then this is the, I guess it was be called the bladder in between the pieces. So you can see, see if I can hold it up so you guys can see it. Um, there is dust that's on the bladder that I am, you know, breathing in, um, but it's not making its way to my system. So I want to show you the inside of the filter after the first use. So you take this, you peel it back a little bit, and look at that. There is no dust on this filter. So even without this, this fabric alone is preventing the dust from coming in, which is really, really great. So um, I think I'm going to get a lot of use out of these. These are going to be used pretty often. And again, they come with, uh, each of these come with one of them, and then you get six extra ones. So <laughs> this is such a great deal. Um, but I'm going to go ahead and finish my bowl now. I just wanted to show that to you. Well, I wanted to show you what the bowl was going to look like at the end of the video, but there was a big crack in it that I didn't see until the very end. So as I was finishing the bowl, then it flew off the lathe and... It's a little jagged on the edge, it's got some big cracks in it. I might turn it down and make it a little bit thinner, but this was going to be a beautiful 11 inch by about a two and a half inch uh, black walnut bowl. Uh, I'll use it for something, I don't know what I'll use it for, but uh, sorry you didn't get to see the final bowl, but it was going to be a nice one. But otherwise, Base Camp, great job on your product. Um, I highly recommend it, 
and I will put the links uh, below for you guys to go ahead and order it. And uh, it worked for me. I don't feel anything in my throat uh, or my nose from the black walnut. And my eyes have cleared up, so um, it's a good product.